plug in the cord to an electric chainsaw. It can run it for three to four days, and it can run a full-size refrigerator for over two and a half days. Hello, welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, I wanna to talk to you about the EcoFlow Delta Pro 3, a powerful, efficient, and backup system for all your off-grid and emergency power needs. Stay tuned. So I don't know about you, but every once in a while here in Southern Ohio, the power goes out. As a matter of fact, last year, we had a tornado come within about a mile and a half of our house. And it seems like every time we get a big storm, the power wants to go out. Now, we live in a time when we are told by the authorities that we could have some pretty bad hurricanes this year. Of course, there's always the tornadoes, depending on where you live. Uh, we have those straight line wind events where you get wind that's over 100 miles an hour, and it just comes through breaking trees and limbs and taking down power lines. So we're always needing some sort of power backup. And there's nothing like having something like the EcoFlow Delta Pro 3 on your side. It really is a very useful unit. Let's get into the details right now. All right, let me pull it here in front of the garage so you can get a good idea what it looks like. It's a pretty good sized unit. It's, it's pretty heavy, it weighs about 115 pounds, but it is still portable and it has some really nice handles on either end, which makes it fairly easy to carry around. It measures about 25 and a half inches long. And including the wheels, it's about 17 inches high or so. It's about 11 inches wide. So this is a perfect size to set in the house somewhere beside your couch or inside of a closet somewhere. Because of its long, narrow profile, it's not too tall, and it does have this nice flat top. You can actually put expandable batteries on here if you need to, but this is a very handy sized unit, and it does have pretty good sized wheels for rolling on rough terrain if you need to do so. Turning it on is quite easy. You just push the main power button, and it immediately comes on. You can see how much is going in on the input side, and how much it's putting out on the output side. The center number represents the total charge of the unit. It has two 100 watt USB-C charging ports and two USB-A charging ports. There are four 110 household outlets and two 220 volt outlets. On the right side is a sliding door which contains another type of 220 outlet. On the left side is another sliding door which encloses three other types of outlets should you need to use those type of connectors. When the power goes out, most people reach for a noisy gas generator, but this is different. The EcoFlow Delta Pro 3 can recharge from empty to full in just a single hour. Plus, it can run your home for days without a drop of gas. Now, maybe you might say, I've got a gas generator. Well, those can be useful for sure, but if you've ever owned one for a while, you know the frustration of trying to get one started that's set for months or even a year or more. Plus, they need to be started and run at least once a month to keep them usable and the gas fresh. Of course, another problem with gas generators is in a disaster, finding fuel can be nearly impossible. Plus, if a generator sets too long, you're looking at carburetor problems and other maintenance issues, and unless you're a pretty good mechanic, you may not be able to get it going. And even when you do get them running, even the quiet ones can be pretty loud. Today, I'm going to show you why this is one of the fastest, quietest, and most versatile home backup power systems that you can find out there today. I'm going to put it to the real test, running power tools, home appliances, and even running a window AC unit. And speaking of running things in your home, my is this ever quiet. Only about 30 decibels, that's like library quiet. I mean, you can plug this thing in and you really don't even know it's there, it's that quiet. And of course, there's no fumes. So it's totally safe to use in the house. Uh, there's no exhaust, nothing like that to worry about. And it's maintenance free. So no oil changes, no spark plugs, no carburetor clean outs. Just keep it charged, put somewhere in a closet or in a garage. And when the power goes off, you pull it out, plug whatever you need to plug into it, and you're ready to go. When you use it indoors to power a small deep freezer, it can run it for three to four days on a single charge and it can run a full-size refrigerator for over two and a half days. I don't know about you, but it is nice to have fresh ice and good filtered water during a crisis or an emergency. Now, if you do have a real power disaster and you wanna plug it in to run your whole house, you have to, of course, make sure, first of all, that your main power switch is off to the house. 
Make sure that you can't backflow the system. You don't want to shock a lineman who's out there trying to repair the lines for you. Then using the special plug that's designed exactly for this purpose, we simply plug it in here, twist it to lock it in, and then place the other end into the transfer outlet, twist the lock in, and you're good to go. And now as you can see, we're running the whole house and it's running at 1436 watts right now of output and the main air conditioner isn't on. And when the power is off and your main AC unit isn't available to cool the whole house, it's nice to know that you can plug in a window air conditioning unit to the EcoFlow Delta Pro 3 and keep right on staying cool. In an emergency, when you have a tree down or several that you need to clear out of the way, you can simply haul the EcoFlow to where you want it, plug in the cord, and then run it over to an electric chainsaw. And just like that, with no problem at all, we've cut off a large part of a fallen tree, took literally less than a minute, now we're ready to go. Charging the unit with one or more solar panels is easy using the solar panels that EcoFlow sells. They have several models. This is a 220 watt. You can also buy the 400 watt and you can combine them for more input power. This one comes in a nice zippered case and it unfolds to a pretty good large size. Now another thing that's interesting about this solar panel this is called their bifacial solar panel. What that means is it not only has solar panels on the front side, but if you turn it around to the rear, it also has solar panels along with the legs that you use to set it up with. So this means any light that's bouncing up off the ground, off of a sidewalk or a driveway, you're not only gonna get light on the front, but also from the backside for extra charging power per unit. So once we get the unit set up and facing the sun at the proper angle, you can use these brackets here. They are adjustable for whatever height you want. And you can see how the light is shining through. And also it's light back here. It'd be enough light to run a solar calculator, for instance. So again, whatever light comes through the back, you're also gaining all that extra wattage. Then you simply take the wires that come out of the solar panel and they snap together very well, just like this and they're made so they only go in one way, so you're not gonna get that confused at all. And the other end is a color-coded plug, and it's shaped a very specific way. On the rear of the unit, which I didn't show you earlier, you have all of your connections for charging the unit. For instance, your extra battery port right there. Again, this is for taking all the way up to the 48 kilowatt hours. You can add the stackable extra batteries to this for extra expansion power. Here you have another AC power input output port that takes this type of plug in. And here we have our AC charge and our solar inputs. So right here, you can see what our plug looks like. And right here we have our input max. You can simply plug that in just like that. Fits perfect. And now we're charging with the power of the sun. And there you can see on the input side, we have 148 watts of power going into the unit. Charging it off the grid is very simple. Plug it in here, standard outlet, and then opening the port on the rear of the unit. Plugs in right here, just like that. You'll hear a click and the fan comes on, and then it shows you your total input and your percentage of charge. Now, for those of you that do have a good working generator, and you also have the EcoFlow, there's something that you can do. Now, if you run a generator continuously, and this is a 2200, so it, it's not nearly the 4000 capacity that this is. If I would try to run things off my house all day on this, it would take a long time. But since this unit here charges in only an hour, I can easily just run this long enough to charge the EcoFlow, and then I'm good to go all night long, and I can take the EcoFlow in the house. So all we have to do is start the generator, plug it in like so, and then opening up this port on the EcoFlow, we plug it in. And now we have an input of 1,745 watts, which will charge the unit in an hour or so.
In short, the EcoFlow Delta Pro 3 is fast to charge, expendable for any situation, runs whisper quiet, and is safe to use indoors. Whether it's powering tools, running appliances, or even running your entire home, it's a clean and reliable solution for everyday and emergency home use. To get your own EcoFlow Delta Pro 3, check the link in the description box below just under the more button, or you'll also find the link in the top pinned comment of the video comment section. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also make sure and check out the links in the description box below just under the more button. While you're down there, you'll find our Waypoint Survival digital class link. And this is where you can sign up to train in the comfort and convenience of your own backyard the top 20 skills that we consider to be the most important from our Phase 1 Survival and Bushcraft class. You'll also find the link for waypointsurvival.com, which is where you can sign up to take in-person classes at our beautiful training facility here in Southern Ohio. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. We'd really appreciate it. And when you do subscribe, make sure and press that bell button so that you can stay notified of all of our upcoming videos. And we'll talk to you next time.